Hello Darts Nuts and welcome to Darts Review Channel. As you know, recently Winmore had their 2021 launch. Um, I've had quite a lot of requests to review the Ted Hankey darts, um, but a lot of the places seem to be out of stock for the Winmore darts. And I got these from Bully Darts and it's owned by a, a guy called Dan Wheatley. And I spoke to him on Facebook, a very nice guy. And it's only a small independent retailer, but he managed to get these out to me pretty quick, considering that there was no stock available. So well done to Dan for that. And this particular version of the Ted Hankey is only in the one weight, 24 grams, and it's on the website, it says it's classed as a special edition. So whether that means they'll only ever be in this particular weight, I don't really know, but we'll check them out. So as I said, it's the Winmore Ted Anki Special Edition, the 24 gram, and you can only get them in that one weight, and they're only in steel tip. The 90% tungsten, when I bought them, they were £39.95, and quite a few shops still have them at that price, but I think recently the prices of the Winmore darts went up, and some shops have them at £42.95. So as you can see, it comes in this Winmore cardboard packaging. Uh, you got a little bit of info on the back and obviously pictures of Ted Hankey and a big window on the front displaying the contents. Inside, the darts are fitted into the Winmore round alloy and plastic point holder. And they come supplied with the Prism Alpha standard shape flights and a set of what look to be short vector stems. So the darts are fit with a black point and it's a tapered style barrel, wider at the front and then tapers to a thinner rear and it's got that distinctive nose which is on a lot of the Ted Anke's darts, kind of looks like a trident cone but um, it's not as flat to the point as I've seen on previous ones. Um, the darts have got a kind of a, a black and gold onyx cone which has been atomized but it's only in the groove so you don't really feel the cone. Um, but I am a little bit disappointed because on the uh, first pictures that I've seen I think there were CGI pictures and that looked as if it was a shinier colour so it kind of has it like a dull colour really so not quite how I was expecting it to look but it's still a very nice start all the same um, and that is kind of more grey than black but kind of nitpicking I suppose as you can see it's kind of a flat narrow ring grip with kind of angled grooves so it's got like a bevel feel and then in the middle it's just two flat rings And there's the Vector short black stems and the Prism Alpha standard flights. Got a slightly see-through uh, nature to them and it's got that embossed pattern on that you can see. The dart's fitted with a black coat 27mm point, it's got a cone shaped nose which is 3.6mm and then the first half of this thin ring grip with the kind of angled grooves that's 20.4mm around the middle you've got a couple of flat rings and a groove that's 3.3mm and then the rest of the barrel continues the same grip as the front for 23.5mm length is 50.8mm width is 7.25mm twenty three point eight eight grams twenty three point seven nine grams so quite a bit of difference there and it's also below the twenty four gram stated weight and twenty three point eight seven grams full setup twenty five point five eight grams 
with nothing attached the balance is a little front of the center and with the supply set up it moves very slightly behind the center point and this is the balance with medium in between short nylon stems and standard flights The grip is pretty uniform across the full length of the barrel and it did feel just a little bit more grippy when I came to throw it so I'd probably say 6 at most overall. <laughs> I knew that was going in, I didn't throw it the same on the last dart. <laughs> but <laughs> balance is quite nice um, obviously I'm a front gripper so it's a front weight <clears throat> so I've got a frog in my throat it's a front weighted style <clears throat> so obviously that means it's chunkier at the front and I know a lot of people don't like chunky barrels but if you're a front gripper you probably know already whether you like this style or not so um, the grip, it's got quite a pronounced feel, it feels a little bit more grippy than I was expecting. Um, I can definitely feel the rings, but I, I kind of thought the rings were like a curve, but I think they're just the way they angled. It's like a flat ring, but it's kind of angled, so it, it doesn't feel like sharp and edgy just seems to release nice and easy out the fingers um, trying it from the black painted groove now but the other thing is the grip is pretty much the full length of the barrel apart from that little bit on the nose so again no reason why it shouldn't work for front middle and rear grippers it just depends if you like this style or not basically getting one dart goes wild um, <clears throat> I was a little bit disappointed about the gold I thought it was a little bit more vibrant and I don't know it just seemed when I've seen the pictures of it as if the gold was more like a gold plate and it doesn't seem like that when I've got the dart it kind of like a, a dull almost painted sandblasted kind of a gold still a nice looking dart but not quite as nice as I, I thought it was going to be so that's the only really thing that I'm disappointed about but other than that it feels quite a pleasant dart to throw and I suppose that's the more important thing so I'm trying the rear section now but I'll find that a little bit harder it gets quite a bit thinner on the rear um, obviously as well when you're throwing it from the rear with it being front weighted it just feels a little bit more pronounced at the front but I often say it's whether or not you're into that style if you're a rear gripper and you like that style then it probably works for you anyway I wish I could uh, throw it half as nice as Ted Hankey though he's got a, a really lovely effortless throw wish I was half as good as him as well
Let's check out the ratings. Although not quite as nice as I was hoping it would be, it's still a very nice looking dart. So 8. Grip overall I'd say 6. Weight match. They were fairly closely matched but they were a little bit below the 24 gram weight. So 7.5. Quality. It's not a really complicated dart but it's machined nicely. So 8. And value 7.5. So there you go, that's the Winmore 10 Hanky. Is it 23 gram? I forget now. <laughs> um, yeah, quite a pleasant dart and a nice front weighted style. Um, nice, easy to release, pleasant ring grip. Not too grippy and certainly not too slippy. My hands are quite cold at the moment, and you know, you get that cold feel where you don't feel as if you've got proper control of the darts, and I didn't have any problems with it. So um pretty effective really um like i said the only thing i was a little bit disappointed was i thought they looked a little bit better in the uh, pre-release pictures by winmore but nevertheless it's still a very nice looking dart um a nice very nice shape so i'll leave you with the gallery so you can have a closer look at it if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet please do so and i'll see you on the next video happy darting